tablet's at risk of falling here. So, you guys like to life game me here, where you, uh, can you even hear me? Hold on. Oh, you guys forced me to take my shirt off on that one. So, here's what's going on. You guys purposely restrict people so that you can make them smaller than you can comprehend. You purposely tell them that they have to have integrity, but your idea of integrity is just saying the same thing forever nonstop. Life isn't just doing the same thing forever nonstop. That wasn't just happening. So the issue with this is, because you continue this form of predation under the idea that it can't be disproven, that it can't be caught, and that we cannot explain it enough for you to actually have to listen to it in time, means that you had the intention of treating life like you could do whatever you wanted, no matter how much people were suffering, and then call yourself a victim when you died. Here's how this is going to go. These guys that refuse to accept that life is good, these guys that refuse to accept that everything's okay, are gonna call me a hypocrite. They already are. <laughs> so take note of where the tablet fell and take note of how hard it is for me to get it back in balance, which is an attempt to get me to press the volume button and turn the video off because I'm catching them. She's gonna send me another message, or the it, even though the messages haven't been re uh, repeating, even though the notifications haven't been repeating, it's gonna repeat even if she doesn't send me another one. So, what these guys would do is call me a hypocrite. They'll say, "Isn't that what he's doing? He's making war. How is he any different than us?" This is their plan. I have this. Do not worry about it. So, all that being said, I'm gonna make two distinctions here. One. I tried my best to prevent this war, but you made it so possible by limiting things this far that I had to let you go. And letting you go is just saying exactly where you're headed. Not my fault. The second mistake I need to make is that these guys who kept saying that it was impossible for everyone to work together, who kept limiting the environment into short logic gates that they could control, who kept saying that you had no integrity if you didn't act on their exaggerations of your beliefs and statements, have been loading up mass, have been loading up content, have been loading up stored energy. And what they're going to do is in order to prevent themselves from being guilty in short proximity, which is why a lot of them are about to get really small, is that they're about to just sit there and keep saying, y'all are dying, y'all are dying. And it is affecting us. It's affecting everybody. Y'all are dying, y'all are dying. And while they're doing that, they're going to try and get you to attack them. And they're not going to goad you. They're not just going to bait you into it. They're going to lost things so far that you're literally pulled into doing it. And they know that's what they're doing. And so when you do it, they'll say, I was attacked. It's not my fault. No, this isn't right. I get to act this way forever. No. Ah, ah. It was the planned hypocrisy that put me in on too fast. Um, and... Uh, I'm going to take some opportunity to say here why I'm not doing that. Number one, you saw me try my best to give every single argument for shared currency and how it was possible for all of us to exist and get along together. You ignored that because you already had a plan for invasion. Perfectly fine. Not fine, but perfectly fine. Let's continue. Second, you keep doing this here where you just choose not to listen or care anymore with all of the excuses that were created by your continuous loss. Your religion was disproven. Your religion was actually comprehended so well that you have to sit here and say that you're just doing what you do. Now you're not any different from the environment. You've lost your story. Now, with all that being said, you're probably still gonna kill me. I really don't care. I already told you what's going to happen. I told you in several ways, several times. If you don't, then you'll just be using that as a, see, he doesn't know everything. <laughs> and if I say that you won't, you'll say, oh, no, we'll actually do it. See, he, no, he doesn't know everything. So at this point, it is what it is. Just want you guys to know that everything I told you is actually possible. And by refusing to accept that when it was the best option for everything alive, 
you put yourselves in the hell that you're going to. You can retaliate against me all you want. You should be angry with yourselves. You had too much time, too much explanation, too much help, too much willingness to go through the things that you wanted to do in order to help you understand. You had too many of those. At this point, you can argue that your initial idea of what was happening caused you to use a strategy of stupefying yourself so far that it's not even your fault you can't learn anymore. But at that point, choosing to stupefy yourselves was literally choosing to make yourself stupid to whatever was challenging you. Not my fault, not anyone else's fault either. No one should have to die because you made yourself stupid. Let's do this.